<clears throat> Alright, hey everyone, I'm Mr. Wolves, and I will be doing a tutorial on how to get mods for both for both Forge and some and there and some that aren't for Forge. So first let's open up the web browser and for the ones that aren't Forge you need seven zip. Now it's either for now if you have thirty two bit or sixty four bit operating systems that's different by what you use so you would either download EXE for 32-bit or M or MSI for 64-bit. Now, once you have that, let's um, Optifine. We'll be I'll be showing you how to get the Optifine mod in. The Optifine mod and MC Capes for ones that aren't Forge. And the and Optifine and MC Capes will be for 1.7.2. No, will be for 1.7.2. Um, so you'd scroll down and you'd click one. And you would download it and save it to your desktop here. And now, MC Capes, you would download it. Now, you want to make sure you get, for this tutorial, you want to make sure you get the, the um, one that isn't for Forge. This one's for Forge. This one isn't. Be sure to get this one. So you would download it, and you have it here. Yep. And now, to get mods that are for Forge, go to the Minecraft Forge website. And to get to the Optifine and MC Capes, just look up. Optifine in your search, in your search, and look up MC Capes. That is, look here. That is MC Cape. That is MC Capes. And uh, <clears throat> MC Capes, you can have your own custom cape. And up to find you can zoom in. All right, I'm babbling. Now we need Minecraft Forge. I use Minecraft Forge 1.6.4 because, well, because um, not many mods are for 1.72 that I can find yet. So you want to go to here, and you want to get the installer. And it'll take you to AdFly. Sometimes that'll happen. Just go back and click it again. <clears throat> so you skip ad. And then it'll give you Minecraft Forge installer dot jar. So now, <clears throat> the heck? It just happened. Okay, where's there's Optifine? And MC Capes. That was weird. Okay. Okay, so you double click the Forge installer. 
And then... Oh, I'll be right back. Alright, I'm back, and so, here we were. <coughs> Excuse me. So, you want to you wanna select Install Client. And you keep the path there unless you changed yours. And you'd click OK, but I already have it, so... And then you go to search, look for percent A P P D A T A, and then another percent sign. If you use, if you use Windows Seven, you would click the start thing and then search it there. <clears throat> so. Um, actually, after you install Forge, um, it won't have everything in, so you'd want to launch Minecraft, And then there will be a new there will be a new profile called Forge. I renamed mine Forge 1.6.4 just because. And then you'd want to hit play. And then I have a couple mods already, but you won't have any if you first install Forge. You might have three because um, sometimes Forge likes to put three folders in your uh, mods folder, but we'll just let this load. And then, once you get to the title screen, which we'll see in just a second, I hope. Schmicko. This is part of the Schmicko Pickle Pack, by the way. Come on, Minecraft, I'm recording. All right, so now we're at here, and <clears throat> it might say zero or three for you. And you have this new mods tab, and it's all your mods. Um, and then to actually install some, you quit game, and then you oh, and then with your percent updated percent thing, you open the dot minecraft folder and then you and then it'll have a new mods folder and say we want to put in wee boy gem mod there all, that's all you have to do to install a mod now to get these two installed, <clears throat> if you're gonna get Optifine and MC Capes, you wanna put in Optifine first. So you'd wanna go to versions, and these are for 1.7.2. So you wanna right click your 1.7.2 folder, copy, right click somewhere else, paste, 
and then you want to rename it whatever you want we'll just call it mod and <clears throat> then you want to open it up and then everything named 1.7.2 you want to call what you called the folder <clears throat> and then you want to open up the json file this 1.7.2 here you want to type in mod and then go to file save and exit out now this is what you got 7-zip for you want to right click the mod.jar 7-zip and open archive now you have this then you want to right click optifine 7-zip 7-zip open archive now you want to press control plus a and then you take all these and put them into there <clears throat> are you sure you want to copy files to archive yes and then it'll take everything from here and put it in there now you want to delete this meta in this meta inf file because if you don't the mod won't work so now you don't need to be fine up so we open the mc capes folder we take these two things and put them into the jar file close it down and there's yet yeah, one more step all right so now this one last step you want to go to new profile and then call it what you want we'll call it mod and then you want to go to here and then release mod save profile and ready to play minecraft mod and in here you should if you done if you did things exactly how i did you should have optifine and mc capes installed all right thank <clears throat> i hope this tutorial helped if you have any questions leave them in the comments below and thanks Thanks for watching and goodbye.